Many of our local districts are looking to hire dozens of positions. School corporations need educators, custodians, food service workers, mechanics, and more. I spoke with one superintendent who says there's a lack of applicants. Inside Ray Crow Elementary, learning is in full force. However, the staff that's keeping kids on track Can you look right here? is working overtime as fewer people are there to help them do their job. Our teachers are vital um, to what we do, but you know, as vital are our classified staff members, our food service team, our uh, custodial teams, our instructional assistants. Those folks are really what kind of makes schools happen. There are more than 60 open positions right now in Clark Pleasant Community Schools. We just are having fewer applicants. To help, Superintendent Patrick Spray is advertising after school jobs to high schoolers. For $15 an hour and 20 hours a week, teens can help fill custodial positions and other jobs. Clark Pleasant is also increasing the minimum wage in hopes that will encourage people to apply. I think all of us are trying to find out something new and different um, in regards to engaging staff. Districts across central Indiana are searching for applicants. Center Grove has 50 openings right now. Same goes for Noblesville. Half of their 50 openings are for instructional assistants. Avon Community Schools is looking to hire substitutes, custodians, and food service personnel. It's been challenging for Warren Township to fill special education and math and science positions. Hamilton Southeastern is looking to fill 40 vacancies. And for Muncie Community Schools, more than a dozen positions are open for support staff. Even before the pandemic, it was starting to get tight, but even through the pandemic, the, the economic you know, growth in our area has grown with you know, e-commerce and distribution facilities. For Spray, working in a school is more than just a job. I think just being around kids it always puts a smile on your face. Now, if you like to apply, there's a link that will connect you with Clark Pleasant Community Schools on our website. That's cbs4indy.com. Just look for this story on our front of our homepage.